Smiling Critters, one of Playtime Co.'s biggest successes. And rightfully so. They were precious, beloved by children and adults alike. Or at least, most of them were. Hmm, looks like we had a little misprint here. No worries. You're going to be with your little messed up friends. In you go! The rest were doomed to be thrown into the flames. Thankfully, these ones weren't alive. But I know somewhere deep down inside, they could feel the misery of not being perfect. Of being a reject. I know exactly how they feel. The Smiling Critters ruled the world of children's toys. They flew off the shelves. Especially Dog Day, their leader, and Bubba Bubba fan as well. With one big exception. Catnap. Playtime Co.'s newest creation. There were reports that he was giving kids across the country nightmares. I know the path of game for us. There really was no coming back from a PR disaster like a toy that prevents kids from getting good sleep. With Katna being a total financial failure, the Smiling Critters brand was almost put on ice. Deciding they had invested too much in the project to give up on it completely, the leaders of Playtime Co. decided to come up with a brand new Smiling Critter. One that went in a new direction. You've seen other cheery smiling critters like Dog Day and Bubba Bubba Fence, but you've never seen anyone quite like Frowny Fox, the brand new smiling critter. Or should I say, unsmiling critter? The newest smiling critter was me. While the others giggle and play, Frowny Fox rests alone, contemplating life's big questions. Unlike the others, he's sensitive, a great listener, and more than anything, longs to be understood. What do you think he's putting in that well? Secrets, Bubba Bubba Fent. Secrets. Frowny Fox, because you can't have rainbows without a little rain. Disclaimer, magical well and cracked mirror not included. <laughs> they were sure that I would be a valuable new member of the Smiling Critters lineup. A bold innovation that would allow them to tap into a whole array of human emotions. So, what do you think of Frowny Fox, my boy? Pretty cool, huh? He... he's... he's even worse than Catnap! He doesn't have any color! <laughs> and he stinks! He smells like wet dog! Well, technically it's wet fox. To say my feelings were hurt was an understatement. Stop that! He's not yours! I'm telling your mother! You failed us, frowny fox. Uh, we couldn't be hip with the kids after all. I should have known you were a mistake. Frowny Fox, what an idiotic idea. Like I said, they loved all smiling critters except for the ones they deemed as failures. And now, I was one of them. I don't know how long I sat in the trash, but eventually, a miracle occurred. Someone saved me. Is this a smiling critter? I don't recognize this one. I don't blame them for getting rid of this guy. Maybe I can use him for parts. My child, what have they done to you? Don't worry, I can fix you. Catnap, he gave me life. What? I'm alive? Oh, thank you so much. I'll take you home. And that leads us to where we are now. Dog day, Baba. Meet our new friend. Um, what's your name? It's Frowny Fox. Frowny Fox? Really? You all get to know each other. Can I play with you? Nah, we're good. Please. Dog Day, give him a chance. Great, that was our last ball. Yeah, thanks for nothing, new guy. Uh, it's okay, uh, maybe we can still use it. Ah. Ew, severed arm, get it away from me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. What a freak! And he smells too! The CEO was right. I belong in the trash. Maybe in the furnace with the others. Don't say things like that! Huh? Uh, who are you? I'm Hoppy! Hoppy Hopscotch! Are you gonna be mean to me like the others? Of course not! There! Good as new! I've never seen your face around here before! I'm Frowny Fox. 
I'm a reject. We're all rejects in one way or another, right? No, I was literally rejected by the kids, by the CEO, and now those two. I'm not good enough for anyone. Well, I won't reject you. I personally think you seem like a good guy. You think I'm good? Of course I do. You don't need those other people. I'll be your friend. Really? Yeah! Wow, this is amazing. I've never had food before. That's crazy! Being alive for the first time? I hardly remember. It feels so long ago. Poppy, what are you doing hanging out with that freak? Snack time, huh? I've got a snack for you! Ah, Hoppy, help! Get out of here, loser! Really? You too? Freddy Fox, no! It was an accident! I didn't mean to hit you! I knew you'd be just like them! I'm leaving! Forever! Freddy Fox, wait! The lab I was made in! It must be this way! Oh, I can't fit in here! But maybe I can fit part of me! Now all I have to do is find the right ingredients! This'll show them all! Here goes everything! <laughs> they have no idea what's gonna hit them! Well, well, well! If it isn't the freak show, I'm surprised you came back after all! You're gonna regret what you did, Bubba! What are you gonna do? Smack me to death with your broken arm? Good luck with that! What the? Don't worry, I won't kill you. At least, I don't think so. <laughs> you again. I figured you went back to the furnace with the other freaks. That's where you belong. Ah! What the? Let me go! Let me go! And why should I? Get ready to take a long nap, dog day. Wait! Hoppy? What do you want? I want you to let Dog Day go! Why should I? Because this isn't the real you! Don't you remember? We had so much fun together! We were friends! You're not mean! They made you this way! You're a good critter! But just because they hurt you, doesn't mean you should hurt them! You're right! Dog Day, you're a jerk, but I'm not gonna hurt you! <laughs> Whatever! I'm out of here! You did the right thing! What have you done? I rescue you, and this is how you repay us? Yeah, no, no! He's changed! I know he's changed. Into a monster! I saw what you did to Bubba. You nearly killed him. I promise not to hurt anyone else, Catnap. Please! Why should I believe you? <laughs> no! No! Hm. That ought to show you. I gave you a chance at life, and you abused it. I better not see you here again. Fox, I... Leave him be. He doesn't deserve your help. Hoppy, why are you helping me after everything I've done? Just because you made a bad choice doesn't mean you're all bad, Brownie Fox. You'll never be a reject to me. Thank you. 